Hello everybody, this is Jonathan and in this video I'm going to be installing LY Login Manager into Bayon and I'll be using it to log into my account. Okay, so basically I've opened up the terminal and I'm going to have to install some packages. Okay, let's get started. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to do sudo apt install build a central lib pam zero g dash dev now we can do lib xcb dash x k b dash dev that is looking good isn't it now best on the enter key now enter your password and that should now allow you to install these packages. Okay, so the next thing we need to do is get clone for repo, where we're we getting for LY from. So to do so, what we need to do is do git clone dash dash resolve dash sub mod yours. HTTPS. Now I'm going to put down for GitHub link, which is github.com dash sir talks software dash ly reloaded. Now, best on the enter key, um, git is not found. Am I not found? Okay, good. Looks like I have to install git. So sudo apt install git. Press on the enter key. Yes, go ahead and install it. Now I'm going to redo for git clone command. I'm just going to press on the enter key and hopefully it's working and it looks like it's working. So I'm going to pause this video and I'll be back once it's done. Okay, so now let's go into the directory by doing cd ly dash reloaded. Press on the enter key. And now type down the make command in order to, com to compile it. Now press on the enter key and it should start compiling. And it looks like it compiled pretty quickly. Okay, so let's go ahead and do sudo make install. Press on the enter key. Okay, it looks like it's done. And now to change it, all you guys need to do is do sudo. So we're, now we are changing our previous login manager to now be using the ly login manager. And it's pretty simple. So let me type down system ctl enable ly dot service if that's on the enter key okay we have to do dash f um let's do dash f at the end of it that's on the enter key and it looks like it has completed okay so now it should be able to um to test it by doing sudo make run okay so it looks like it is working um, so you should be able to put down your login as you guys can see and put down your password you guys can type down f1 to shut down f2 to reboot um, and you guys can also change your desktop environment but it's not going to work because it's just mostly uh, made for testing purposes. So all you need to do now is just press on the escape key. I think it is always a control C. Okay, so just press on to control C to exit. And okay, that's looking good. Um, let's go ahead and um, if we need to switch between TTYs after LY starts, you also have to disable Getty on LY 
TTYs to Bentfront login from spamming on top of it. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. So you put down system CTL, CTL, disable getty at tty2.service. If it now pass on the enter key, looks like it worked. And now let me go ahead and reboot the system and see if we have that new login manager working. So I'm going to do sudo reboot. Press on the enter key and it should start rebooting. Dubai and GNU Linux. Awesome, it is not working and from here we'll be able to change the desktop environment by using the arrow keys. So we can go up and down with the arrow keys as you guys can see. And you guys can also change the desktop environment by using the left and the right um, arrow keys like so. So we can switch to GNOME, we can switch to um, XFC if we wanted to. I'm going to go ahead and select the, um, let's go ahead and select XFCE. I'm going to go down to login and then from here I should be able to put down my username which I think is um, Jonathan Stedman and now I should be able to enter my password which is 123 but you guys can also type down you guys can also um, type down F1 to shut down F2 to reboot and that will allow it to shut down and reboot the system so it's as simple as that so now press on the enter key once you finish writing out the password and that should allow it into the desktop environment. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, please put a like and please subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.